Welcome to episode two. I just, you know, started from there and came up here. I'm gonna try to get the Drake Sword using melee instead of ranging its tail from here with a bow. So you can also get the Drake Sword that way. I am going to hop on some gold pine resin. Wait for the Drake to land on its feet. Because it'll get impatient for me. My haircut looks super dumb. Just gotta wait a little bit. Throw in my pine resin. Oh, perfect timing, perfect timing. Go, 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 go. I missed his tail. I missed his tail. I don't believe I just missed his tail. I'm dead. How did I miss his tail? Holy cow! I missed his tail. I know I, I said that like a bunch, but this weapon has such a long arc and swing. I'm just. I guess I'm gonna have to do it with this fight with this axe. I'm really gonna have to mash down my right bumper just to get it, because you can't afford to miss it. And I think I need four hits. And I might be just short on stamina. How? I'm gonna pop gold pine resin. This will be my last chance of getting it. Hopefully, it comes down soon. Drake sword. Now I'm going to send this Drake away. Because resting at this bonfire makes him vanish. So, just note for you guys yourself if you do want to end up fame farming this area, well, fame farming, um, soul farming, you can't do it. I just, you can't rest that bonfire. And then here's where you can join the uh, Sun Bros. Gonna take damage, aren't I? Level up? Yep, take damage. And join the Sun Bros right here. You need 25 faith. Or. I don't think it's gonna attack because I don't have enough faith. Or every time you help a person, it lowers the faith requirement down by one. I'm just short on leveling up. All right. Well, that sucks. Now that I have the Drake sword, I'm 100% sure I don't have the dex to use it. Um, Drake sword is up. Toggle display. Oh, no. I can use it. Sweet. I'm going to use the Drake sword for now. Just for that extra bit of damage. That's a medium rolling. Uh, let's take off that. Medium rolling. Let's take off chest. Light rolling. Okay. I like to write light roll. I feel much more comfortable. I'm definitely a roller more than a dodger. But I do dodge it uh, quite a bit of times. I'm not going to lie. Definitely not scared of dodging. Of, I mean of blocking. I prefer to dodge roll. Drake Sword is a great overpowered weapon at the start, but it quickly trails off endgame for very low damage. Fire does much damage to him. Pretty sure that was like a direct hit, but okay. Yeah. 
Yes, that's what I wanted. Get some poise. Not that I'm doing PvP, but I don't, I don't get knocked back as bad. Nope. Run. Put the helmet back on. Okay. Dumb. Don't fall off. Man. Guess I need to throw some alluring skulls down. Alluring skulls. Here we go. Ah, whew. I thought I was going to fall too. I would actually really like his helmet. Yeah. Such badass. And I didn't get his helmet. And because I didn't sprint, I didn't get that, so I shut the gate, so I gotta go the long way around. One second, that's my alarm. Currently, 9 o'clock a.m. I am up super early. And now I need to feed my dog once I rest at this bonfire. Oh my gosh. Can I? Okay. I can't have the attack, but barely. There's an ambush. At least I thought there's an ambush. Okay, that's not too bad. They're giving me absolutely terrible uh, souls, uh, amount of souls, but that's perfectly acceptable. Where'd that guy come from? And that fall never happened. Oh, there's a soul there, isn't there? I need that soul. I need all the souls I kill. Oh, it's a mystery key. Wonder if that's to unlock the. Uh... I don't remember his name, but he gives you the row fat. Uh, Ring of favor and protection. Oh yes, a broken straight sword. Just what everybody needs. Alright, to the right up here. I know there's a shield. I think I'm going to get the shield. I'm not going to use it. I think I'm just going to get it so I can get it. Let's walk up on this guy. And then quick go. Oh. That just burns the durability on this weapon, but I wanted him dead. Like, its durability dropped a lot. It's at 297 now. And I, if I remember correctly, the durability doesn't replenish every time you rest at a bonfire like it does in the other Dark Souls, like Dark Souls 2 and 3. Come on, attack. Or shield bash, that works. I rolled.
It'd be really cool if I get this Balder side sword. Not that I'm going to do a dex build. I already got 24 strength. I mean, if I'm lucky enough and get the... Um, what's it called? The Black Knight Halberd, I will absolutely... Oh, I actually got the kick in. I'll absolutely use the Black Knight Halberd, but I don't know if I'll be lucky enough to get it on the one Black Knight kill that has it at this like early part of the game. I could go that way and unlock it. Yeah, I'll go this way and unlock it. Unlock the uh, this gate over here. Ooh, good side jump guy. Like only if that was like a PvP roll, like you know, that'd be awesome. Bring that up. Get some unlucky and die. Here's the halberd. The halberd is one of my favorite weapons in this game. Um, what I would used to do is I would, like, I really enjoyed PvP at low levels because if you made a mistake, you were dead. Because almost everybody who was low level around like 20 ish, they had a chaos weapon at plus 5. So if you had 10 humanity on your counter, you'd do more damage. And I would get the gargoyles halberd at 20 combat. Uh, put in a couple points of HP or stamina just so I can, you know, roll longer, maybe survive that extra little hit. But I would easily fight people 120 combat and two shot them at my low level. Just because how powerful Chaos plus five weapons are with 10 humanity. Now, do I level up or do I... I think I'm gonna level up currently just because I have the Drake sword. Otherwise, I would spend these souls on Titanite shards. I do apologize if you do hear that light barking in the background. That is my neighbor's dog. I guess I'll go human. Reverse Halloween, sure. I swear, if I get invaded, I don't. I don't know what I'll do, but I'll be upset. I'll be really upset if I actually get invaded. While my dog was eating, I ran up there, killed people, came back, used all of my souls I had in my inventory, and got one hit point level. Now I am going to go through and hopefully kill the gargoyle boss on my first shot. I also gained one humanity somehow. Interesting. Okay. There's actually a... People still play this game on multiplayer? I might have to summon him just because of that. Like, holy cow. I'm impressed. I'm just... I'm gonna summon him because of that. Like, dude, whoever you are, you are a man among men, that's for sure. All right. I chew out here. All right, someone just uh, beat the gargoyle boss and ring the bells. Oh my gosh, that did so much stamina drain. Or not, don't attack. That that works too. I I don't mind it when you don't attack. Fucking stupid buttons. Okay, I'm not surprised that it failed. All right, gotta bait him into that second one. No, 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 no. Bad guy, bad Titanite soldier guy. Dude, I'm getting all of the good drops. I can't even use any 28 strength. So that's, physical's 130. What's the physical on the Zweehander? 130. Oh. I wonder what does more damage in the end. Let's see, that's CD scaling. That's CC scaling, and that is also CD. So I guess I'll, 
I'll test out the. Oh, I can't use it. Are the moves? I think the move set's the exact same. Ooh, I like that thrust. But I think that's the exact same. This is why. No, it's not. Okay. Oh wait, I was two, I was one handing that I think. I need to two hand it. No, okay. That's a full bar of stamina drain. All right, dude. You tried to be my hero. I accepted that and it didn't work out. So now I'm gonna ride this elevator and not actually go down with it because you can press B and jump back and outsmart the elevator. How, how wide is this swing? Okay, that swing is way too wide. I might die here just because I tried to use this weapon. <laughs> okay, this is where I die a lot. Just simply because it's, you know, you're overwhelmed with the amount of people and they get buffed up by Captain D bag over there. Wow. I, uh, normally he. Oh, geez. Get them all, get them all, get them all. Yeah. That, see, that, that's worth when you just waste the durability on that and you get at least four kills out of it. I am impressed on how well I am doing, although I didn't get the Channeler's Trident, which is Chancellor, Channeler's. I don't, I just remember it starts with a C. I don't remember the name of it. But that trident is super fun with when you invade worlds. You can buff mobs around them by doing like the press Y to two hand it, and then you can uh, words. Words are so difficult. And then use the R2 to do the special attack, and you'll dance and you'll buff mobs around it. Super cool. Can we grab this humanity way around this corner? I think it's a humanity. Yeah, this is humanity. Let me just heal up. I need three health, health for fighting this guy. I can fight him now, or I could fight him way later. Well, not way later. That's not a delusionary wall. You can kill him now and get the ring now, or you can wait a little bit and then kill him. Personally, I'm just gonna kill him now. Um, and I'm gonna make this really hard on myself by hold up. Let me two hand it. Now let's check the stats. How do you... Okay. They're the same. But just the move set's different. Thank you. Who are you? Yes, very much. Oh, you're dead to me. Great 
So you parry a fireball. No, but he cannot roll it. Yeah. I know what I'm doing when it comes to this game still. Let me get that ring, the Rofap. R O F A P. It seriously boosts health, stamina, and your weight. Now I'm gonna take the great sword off. Now I only have uh, two Estus to kill the gargoyle boss, which is a lie because I'm. You don't know. No, I'm only gonna have two Estus. I don't wanna re go through and kill everything. Oh, congratulations! Somebody else on playing Dark Souls. Does that mean they're not playing on the remastered version? Because I don't think I can play with people on the remastered version. I don't know. I think the servers would be different. I have no idea. I don't know if I said this, but I'm not playing with DS Fix. I just forgot to install it. To be honest, before I started playing, I was so excited to be like, yeah, I'm playing Dark Souls. I was like, yes. Just woke up and really started recording instantly because last night I was laying in bed thinking about it. And I'm like, yeah. I'm definitely playing this game again for my YouTube channel. I like this game way too much to not play it. Well, I can indeed I fell off. I am going to summon Solaire. He'll make the boss's health a little stronger, but Solaire's Solaire. He's a pretty chill guy. Um, I did get, gain some more stamina, so... Maybe I can press B and learn how to actually back out of things and equip this and still light roll. Yeah. What if I did this? That's a medium roll. That's a medium roll. Head it is. Solar, it is good to see you. It has been mel many, many moons. If you're playing this with a friend, if you have a friend run to just past half, like really right ab above my helmet, like just a little farther than that, uh, you can instantly get the gargoyles from the back. And I, I can't skip this, can I? Yes, I can. Okay, that's one gargoyle down. It would be really cool if I could get his helmet. Get your helmet, get the helmet for some poise. No, okay. See, this game is still pretty easy. You just have to know what you're doing. The learning curve in this game is pretty steep, but the second you actually figure out what you have to do, it's snappy. You pick things up so quick you wouldn't believe it. Now I believe the proper way from here is for me to head back to the bonfire where the drake was. Not underneath it, the little before the drake where you can drake where you can f f uh, soul farm, farm souls. I keep on wanting to call it fame farm thanks to Albion, but you're farming souls in this game. And now I ring the bell. But you want to go to that bridge. I believe you have to run down the bridge or back through the Taurus Demon. I think that's the way you have to go. Because normal, honestly, normally I will pick any class I want. Well, like two years ago, I would pick any class I want, head straight to Quelag or Quelag, whoever you want to pronounce her name. You can't, okay, you can't press B. 
kill that kill her then come straight up to gargoyles kill gargoyles and then go right into the sense fortress that was that was how i used to play this game and i could do that at any soul level in the game like starting classes without a problem it was just super easy because you know i i have over 5,000 hours in this game crossed you know playing this game on xbox on pc on playstation 3 on xbox i had so many pvp characters i had like four or five like uh usb uh usb storage devices converted into xbox storage and i just had like everyone had 10 characters on for pvp so if i wanted to switch to this class i just reload the game pop in the new hard drive and play i want to learn the gesture not that that matters i want to purchase an item i want to purchase i don't have enough for the poison resistance and leveling up would be more useful i'll buy uh I'll buy three homeward bones. You're not welcome. I'm not gonna. I I should use it. No, no. I'm not gonna use a homeward. I should use a homeward bone. It'll make things quicker. But I'm not going to. I'm gonna head to the main bonfire at the at actually Firelink Shrine. Going to head there. Um, going to use my. What is the thing called? Uh, Firekeeper Soul. Oh shit, I got them on me. And upgrade that so I can get plus one Estus. And then after that, I will head to... I think it's the sewer? No, there's a boss before the sewers. Uh, it's like a... Is, is it called a Capra Demon? I'm not too sure. If you drop down here, there's a bunch of treasure chests. None of them are mimics, don't worry. Oh, the Morning Star, that's a good bleed weapon. And it's a bleed strength weapon, actually. Hmm. Do I go take on the Asylum Demon again? Since I have a bleed weapon now? Nah, I won't do that. Oh, I didn't even talk to the merchant that has the Uchi Katana. I kind of forgot that was a thing. Some more souls. Does the gargoyle soul drop? A gar I don't remember if the gargoyle boss actually drops a soul for him. No, he does. Crestfallen warrior. I actually like the chainmail in this game. I think it looks pretty chill. The muted bonfire keeper. Reinforce masters last for a plus one. Thank you, ma'am. She doesn't talk. No point in talking to her. Level up. Okay, so I think I'm gonna... Two points in vitality, two points in... Ooh. Nah. One extra point in vitality. The reason I'm not just leveling them up one full at a time, I'm, you know, one point in this, one point in that, is because just to keep my... Cool, uh, and more balanced so I can gain health and still roll rather than just well, I have all this health but I can't roll or oh I can roll but I have you know, no health so I'm gonna you know keep on spreading it up I'm only 300 soul short dang so I don't know it'll be faster if I run through all of that again or if I go I'm gonna go up and head back and I will just see you at that next bonfire. Thanks for watching.